Here's the Panda now, Pablo Sandoval. Starting things for his side in the ninth as they face the improbable odds of trying to come back in this one. Yeah, not a lot of hope for them at this point. These guys know these bats still count, at least for their own stats. You can't mill in your chances as a professional. Here's the first pitch. This is line to left. He dives. Did he catch that? He did. What a play there for the first oh, out. Jumped all oh, over that first pitch of the inning, and he didn't miss it. Just wasn't able to steer it in a direction that resulted in a leadoff hit. The left-handed hitting Andrew Benintendi stands in as the first pitch to him is swung on and missed for strike one. 0 for 2 for him to this point. This is chopped foul at the plate. He's in the hole now, down 0 and 2. Now the 0 2 pitch. And he missed with it. It's 1 and 2. Hey, not a bad pitch right there on 0 and 2, a fastball. And I think as a hitter right now, you have to continue to go up there looking to hit off the fastball. Now the one and two pitch. And this is going to find the crowd down the left field line. Count holds at one and two. Ready with another two strike offering. Strike three. So now he's one out away from perfection. Good job of making him chase a pitch for the strikeout there. Yeah, Catcher. Matt, that's the advantage of getting ahead in the count. Right you hard. can really force hitters to expand their zone and protect. And when they're in that mode, getting them to go after a pitch they can't do much with becomes a lot easier. And that'll bring in the speedy catcher, Blake Swihart. Swing, and he pops him up. This should do it. Longoria is there, makes the catch, and he's done it. A perfect game. Yeah, you've heard when it rains, it pours. Well, it was raining dominance out here in this one. 27 up, 27 down, and he barely broke a sweat half the time. That's one of the rarest feats in all of sports, and I'm just excited I was here to be a part of it. Perfection is always beautiful. Well, you don't have to look too far to find our tops player of the game. I'd say any time you throw a perfect game, you'd be a pretty strong candidate. Yeah, there's absolutely no debate as far as I'm concerned.